Hello and welcome to Friday's Daily Financial Report. The dollar-yen pair fell 0.4% in the last session. The stochastic indicator is giving a negative signal. The Bitcoin dollar pair rose 0.9% in the last session after gaining as much as 2.8% during the session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. The gold got a slight bump of 0.1% against the dollar in the last session. The ultimate oscillator is giving a negative signal. The oil dollar pair dove 1.8% in the last session. The Williams indicator is giving a negative signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. Those were today's major economic events, and now moving on to world financial headlines. Wall Street dipped after weekly jobless claims fell to a near 18-month low, allaying fears of a slowing economic recovery, but also stoking worries the Fed could move sooner than previously expected to scale back its accommodative policies. Blockchain firm Blockstream Mining said it would partner with Australian financial conglomerate Macquarie Group to develop Bitcoin mining facilities that use renewable energy. The dollar found support from Kasha's risk sentiment stemming in part from worries about the Delta variant, while the Euro looked to the European Central Bank policy decision. Coming up are chief analysts' choices for today. The U.S. Producer Price Index will be released at 12.30 GMT, the U.K.'s Gross Domestic Product at 600 GMT, Japan's CFTC JPY NC Net Positions at 19.30 GMT. The U.S. USDA WASDE Report will be released at 1600 GMT, the U.K.'s Manufacturing Production at 600 GMT, Germany's Harmonized Index of Consumer Prices at 600 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.